common mistakes salespeople make and proven strategies to avoid them. And in today's video, we're going to talk about the reasons why most salespeople fail and what you could do to avoid making the same mistakes. Get into the video. Now, we've all seen salespeople who seem to be struggling to make a sale, even when it seems like they're doing everything right. And while there are many factors that can contribute to a lack of success in sales, there are a few key mistakes that most salespeople make that can seriously hinder their success. Mistake number one, not knowing your product. The first mistake that many salespeople make is not fully understanding their product or service. It's impossible to sell something effectively if you don't know what you're selling or how it works. And how can you pass over your positive belief about your product if you don't fully understand it? For example, if you're selling a software product, you need to be able to explain the features and benefits in a clear and concise way. If you can't do that, you're going to have a hard time convincing anyone to buy it. Make sure to spend some time properly understanding your product. If you're new to the product, write out some flashcards on the key elements and practice the flashcards and sooner or later, you'll have a better understanding. A good understanding leads to a good ability to sell. Mistake number two, focusing on the wrong people. The second mistake that salespeople often make is focusing on the wrong people. This can happen if you're not clear on who your target market is, or if you're trying to sell to people who just aren't interested. If you're not targeting the right people, you're wasting your time and energy, which ultimately is costing you money. Instead, focus on finding people who are already interested in what you have to offer. Then, do your absolute best to sell to the people who are interested. This is where the money's made. Mistake number three, not listening. The third mistake that salespeople make is not listening to their customers. It's easy to get caught up in trying to sell your product or service, but if you're not listening to your customers' needs, you're not gonna be able to provide them with what they want. Make sure that you take the time to listen to your customers, understand their pain points, and tailor your pitch to their specific needs. This way, a customer will feel like their concerns being heard and therefore feel comfortable in your presence. Then you can advise them on what's best to do and from there, sell them the best product or service for their needs. Mistake number four, not following up. Finally, the fourth mistake that salespeople make is not following up with potential customers. It's not enough to make a sales pitch and then walk away. You need to follow up with potential customers and keep them engaged throughout the sales process. This can be as simple as sending a follow-up email or giving them a call to check in. It shows that you're interested in their business and it can help keep you top of mind. Therefore, even if they don't buy it right away, you'll be the person they think of when they're considering buying. So, those are the four most common mistakes that salespeople make. To avoid these mistakes and improve your sales success, make sure that you fully understand your product or service, focus on the right people, listen to your customers, follow up with potential customers,